Hey guys, this is Ordinary Gamer, and today I'm going to be giving you a full Geodude guide. So we're going to be talking about how to get Geodude, uh, what's the best build for him, uh, what moves and stuff, um, how you should use him on your team, and yeah, pretty much everything there is to know. So the easiest uh, soup to make uh, for Geodude is a stone soup a la cube. Uh, I don't think I have it here. But basically, you're going to use two fossils and three apricorns. So yeah, basically, it's going to take two expeditions. I'll just automatically hatch it here. Uh, yeah. And you should get this. A stone soup cube. Also, uh, today we have a special guest, uh, Ralts. Ralts? Does YT? <clears throat> this is the second collab we've done. Yeah, and um, he makes horror game videos. So if you want to watch his content, I'll link his YouTube. I'll link right his now, channel. I'm taking a little bit of break, so mm. I'll be back in like a few days. I'll link his channel in my description. But yeah, so we have Geodude here, and um, what the best? Wait, uh, what game is this? This is Pokemon Quest. Oh. It's like a level based game. It's like the dead version of Pokemon. Kind of. It was I super. I don't really see much videos of these. Yeah, but yeah. So Geodude, uh, that I don't. Pokemon in this game don't really have weaknesses. I don't think. So for the best build for him, you're gonna want to have one move, and that move you you're gonna want to be hardened. So we have hardened here, and it, <laughs> shut up. And you want to have this buddy stone right here. You want to have three of those equipped to harden so that it shares the effect with all of his allies. So it should share a 75% defense increase with all of his allies. Um, you can also run Dig if you want to do a more offensive golem, but Harden is generally better uh, if you're not going to use Machamp. And for stones, you're going to want uh, probably 6 health and 3 uh, attack. So I've got 1, 2, 3 here, and then 6 health, so this is a pretty good Geodude besides not having 2 moves. Um, so yeah, so with, uh, three attack and six, uh, health, you're gonna have a lot of health, because the golem is already super tanky, uh, so you're gonna basically live forever with Harden and your crazy HP stat, but then you'll also be able to do, uh, decent damage with your basic attacks, because of your, uh, three damage stones. And then for bingo bonuses, it... It's, it's kind of diverse. It's kind of diverse. You could run HP, uh, standard attack, uh, standard attack uh, frequency, or if you're running dig, you could do attack of ground type moves like I have here. Uh, but it doesn't really matter too much. Uh, or you could do normal type move weight if you do get that. I don't know if you can, but you can run that. So uh, yeah. And then for the position you're going to run him on the team, you're going to want to run him as your tank, since he ha Golem has one of the highest HP stats in the game, if not the highest. So where you'd run your, like your Machamp, uh, you'd put Golem instead, because it basically lives forever. So like you put it in the first slot, and then it just takes all the hits. Uh, yeah. And then you can just keep making more stone soups. And if you end up getting a ride on, that's also good because you can run ride on with a golem since it's like a mid guy. So you can so ride on you want it's ride on's really balanced. So you can have like mega horn and attack and health even, and then like possibly some bug type move weight if you have that. Uh yeah, and. If you're wondering how to evolve Geodude, Geodude evolves once at level 16 into Graveler, and then evolves again at level 36 into Golem, which is how a lot of three-stage evolutions in this game work. <laughs> so, yeah. And then, yeah. Uh, that's gonna be it for this video. Uh, Ordinary Gamer, peace out.